What's up, people of the world? This is Alex Wimmer, aka If You Threw Jumped, and today is the day after the 4th of July, and before y'all get into the, oh, it's too late, it's too late to celebrate the 4th of July, you're dead late, you can't fuck it, blah, 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 blah. No! Shut the hell up. I'm going to tell you why I didn't do a vlog yesterday on the 4th of July. I didn't feel like doing a vlog on time on the actual day of 4th of July because I was really tired yesterday and there's a story behind all this. It started... It started Friday on... Um... It was the first of the month that... No. It was the last day of June. Friday, June 30th. Friday night. There was this really, really big storm that happened called a derecho. If y'all don't know what a derecho is, early fun fact, but a derecho is a collection of storms that later, well, yeah, it's a collection of storms that bundles and bundles and bundles and bundles and bundles and they get really, really big and turn to this one massive bar. It, derecho means, derecho is Spanish for straight, and if you look at the map here, see why they call it derecho, because, since derecho is Spanish for straight, it's like a, this long straight bar of just, just thunderstorms, and 600 miles long, we are just if y'all can't see that then over 500 pretty preliminary thunderstorm weather reports indicated by peak wind gusts 80 to 100 miles per hour millions without power so so yeah and I mean yeah this weekend, we were originally supposed to move into my new house, but since the thun because of the thunderstorm, that fucked everything up. We were originally supposed to move this Saturday, but we didn't completely move until Wednesday, which was yesterday, the 4th of July. <laughs> yeah, we didn't start moving until Tuesday, and it took us two days to move, actually, so... Let me see. Let me see where to start. On Friday. Hang on a second. Let me think about this. Time we got three minutes and thirty. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> so Friday, the the that show hits. All four of these, all these states right here. Yeah, the 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 derecho hit all this, and it hit it on Friday, like I said. And we were without power, so we had to sleep without power in the hot, and it looked. Like I said, millions without power in all in Virginia and well, Rocky Mount, Franklin County, Lynchburg, and the other. Yeah. So we had to go. Several people had to go to hotels. We did too. We had we stayed at three different motels. Okay, so. Okay, so my dad. He, before the storm, he went to Rocky Mount at Uncle Alex's house, you know, where I filmed my band in elevators, because they, they're here. So, him, Big Alex's house was without power, too. And, Michelle, my dad's girlfriend, was without power, too. So, she came over at Uncle Alex's. Or, well, I think this happened before the power went out over at his house. 
And they went, they had to go to all the way to North Carolina to stay at a hotel because they had, they couldn't find a place in Virginia that accepted dogs. So they stayed in North Carolina for about the same amount of time me and my mom and my stepdad did. Yeah, we all stayed out at our respective hotels for three days. And we all came back around Monday. And... That was the day we moved. Sorry, I'm having so many brain farts right now. It's hard for me to contemplate this whole story in my mind, so just bear with me. Probably should have said that earlier, but... Damn it! Okay? Now we're... Where is my... Yeah, dude. I'll get to you later. Okay. Yeah, it took us about two days to move, to move everything. So, we were all hot as hell, and... We didn't act... There wasn't power at the old house, but there was power at the new house. That's why we all wanted to get the hell out of there. We had all the boxes packed. We had to... We had to... Take all that out and put it in the U-Haul. You know how that goes. But it was hot. It was up and down, up and down steps and hills and slopes at the old house. That's why it pissed everybody off and made everybody tired. And then we took the little, we took the U-Haul to the new place. Well, this was this was after my dad came back to run. I should probably go back a little before before we started moving. Big Alex's house had power. Michelle's house didn't have power, so Michelle, my dad's girlfriend, her house didn't have power, so she stayed with Alex. And yeah, that was before we moved. And you know the whole moving situation and after the steps and all that crazy crap, we moved into a new house and it was it was much easier trying to it was much easier getting out of there than we got stuck on the road for a little bit, but we, we somehow we somehow managed to get out. We got stuck in some gravel or something like that because it, it's a it's a slope, and the house is like like this this slope. So we had to. It was it was really hard to to tell the gravity inside the U-Haul while we were, we were taking stuff out of the U-Haul. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's probably what y'all are thinking. Because I don't know how to tell a story. <laughs> that's my screen server, by the way. Anyway, back on topic. So we're at the new house. The slope, like I said, the gravity was screwing the truck because the truck was on the hill, slanted and sloped. It was hard. It, we all got disoriented. Some of us got disoriented. Well, all of us did. Some of us got disoriented in the truck and did, did, did. Well, you pretty much know what happens. We got all the stuff out and got into the new house. So, you're probably wondering, oh, well, why are you over here and not back over there helping with the stuff? Because I don't really have an answer for that. I, I really don't. So... Hang on, let me. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Let me think about this real quick. They're racing over there, so that pretty much ties up all the loose ends in the story. John, my brother Jonathan, he still doesn't. He still doesn't have power, so he's over at Uncle Alex's, along with me. So, I don't really have a reason for why I'm over here and not over in my my new house. So we, because I'm spraying myself like butter. I like That's why I do to collaborate with people. I I'm not my own group like other people. I spray myself like butter metaphorically and hang out with different groups and different different groups of friends, and different family members and all at the same time. Yeah. Cuz that's how butter is. It gets all over the place at the same time. 
You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a per terrible joke, I know. <laughs> I know it's terrible, but just fucking do it. Okay. Uh, how'd you like my teeth? <laughs> anyway, so it's over at Alex's house. It's me, my dad, Jonathan, Michelle, Alex, and the pugs. And while I'm at it, I might do random... Probably not today, but I'll do a random video tomorrow. And if I can, I'll do another, do more footage of Bandit and Ellie. And probably do that cover song I'm, <laughs> I've been trying to do uh, with Mr. Moose. I want to give y'all heads up right now. I'm going to die in all my cover songs. At the very end of each cover song, I will die. Yeah, that's gonna be the thing, the, the, like the meme in those, those videos, yeah. And I might do another gaming video this weekend too, and so my mom and Eddie are at the new house. The house is pretty good, it, pretty cool, I, I'll i show you the layout later, That this will be a different video, I'll, t I'll show you the house in another vlog. I will say this though, I had weird... I had weird feelings for it at first. Well, at first, when, as soon as I went into the house, I haven't been into it before. We moved into it. When, as soon as I went into there, I thought it was cool. It smelled like the skates there. And then afterwards, I started seeing signs that it was... It didn't really... I didn't really feel good about it. That I will say that. But... Then I came to my senses that the sat that same night and still thought it was awesome. That's all y'all need to know. <laughs> so yeah, here at Uncle Alex's on the bed in this other room. Guess that's time. Randomness. Random object of the day is a lollipop. It is a cotton candy lollipop that I got while I was in the motels. I got this at the... I don't know what the fuck I wrote. It's a lollipop, dude. <laughs> Ain't no, the only thing special about this is this made of cotton candy. You got... You got <laughs> I'm going ballistic. Meh. At least a furious man in here. Y'all remember him? Oh, I thought I was coming. What if I played this clip? Then you'll then you'll remember. Oh no! Oh no! No! Where? Where is it? It's the furious man! Yo! What do you want me to? No, Joy. It doesn't matter. I run from you. Here's man. I killed Joy. I know it's hard to tell, isn't it? But why is the camera rolling? Because I'm doing a vlog. Why are you doing a vlog? No, I just. It's like, oh, okay. Look, I'm just. I'm just. I'm just gonna hear and look. Oh, you look. I ever catch you doing another happy dance again? Oh, well, let's, let's kill Joy. Kill Joy's at here. He's at home. You can kill Joy. That's not the point. The point is, if I ever catch you doing another happy dance, I will beat you so badly with the sumo. It's not even funny. You're right. You remember him now, don't you? <laughs> Random fun fact of the day, did you? No? Is that... Well, I've already told the random fun fact for you earlier. If you want to go back to that, it was uh, like the first part of the video. I'm just checking the clock on, that, to, to, on the time. Anyway, that pretty much wraps up for me. Comment, rate, subscribe, do what you gotta do. And all, the, all the links and this stuff, and I... I'm at a real loss for words right now, and I don't know how to...
Okay. Here he comes. Coming to kill me. My dad, which I refer to as the crazy man. The crazy man he is. So. Thanks for putting up with my crazy bullshit that I call speech. <laughs> and that's all for me. And I'll see you soon. Happy birthday, America. Happy birthday.